So you just bought a brand new pair of shoes. What's the first thing you should do once you get them home? If you guess, give them a protectant wax polish, you'd be right. Gentlemen, Mark Antimate here for the Gentleman's Club. A wax polish is essential to protecting your new shoes against light scuffs and also water damage. But how do you wax your shoes? What products do you buy? Luckily in this video, I'm going to show you. So I just bought this $300 new pair of Made in Japan Oxfords and I intend to keep them essentially forever. You start with keeping your new investment looking good by making an investment in them. For polishing products, I recommend Saphir. In my opinion, they're the best in the world. So let's take a look at what I bought. These products are available all around the world by the way, but are made in France. I bought mine out of a department store in Tokyo called Sogo. The first thing you need is a cotton chamois cloth. This product is the Saphir Renovateur, a mink oil based cleaner conditioner. From the Takashimaya department store, I bought the Saphir Made I Dior Pat Deluxe Wax Shoe Polish. And I bought the Saphir Cream 1925 and a Saphir horsehair brush with the old Saphir logo on it. Saphir have about 13 different colors or so that you can match your shoe color to. But my shoes are such a distinctive brown that I didn't want to change them at all. So what I did was buy all their neutral clear color products from the wax to the cream and renovateur. You want to start out by removing the shoelaces so that when you wax and polish, for one, you get the whole shoe covered, and two, you don't gunk up your laces with wax. After you remove the laces, you want to brush off any excess surface dirt on your shoes with the horsehair brush. We start by applying the Renovateur first, which is a conditioner, that contains mild cleaning agents. Apply in dabs and move around in a small circular motion just the same as you would a wax. At the end of the application, buff with your horsehair brush just the same as you would after applying a wax. Next, we are going to apply our first coat, a Saphir Cream 1925. Essentially, this is almost the same as a wax, only lighter. The reason this is important is because you can apply this all over the entire shoe, including the vamp. The vamp is the part of the shoe in the middle where you bend your foot at and where the natural creases in the shoe occur. If you were to put a wax in the vamp area, it'll cake up leaving a white residue there, as well as making that area more rigid.
Because this is my first time ever applying absolutely anything to these shoes, I applied the cream twice as a foundation. After each application, buff out your shoes to a shine. Finally, we're on to the Pat Deluxe Wax. This is the best product possible for producing a shine to your shoes. Because this is a hard wax, it's best only to apply it to the heel and toe, also called the cap areas of your shoe, where bending does not occur. You can apply this as many times as you want and work as long as you want to producing a better and better mirror shine. But because I've been working at my shoes all day from the beginning process, I only applied twice today. I used some wax and a small bit of water to help me produce an even greater shine, a process I learned while in the military. This is called a glissage. It's French for icing. At the end of it all, buff it out. You should be left with a better off protected shoe against the elements than when you first bought them, as well as they should have a more lustrous shine to them. Well, I thank you gentlemen for watching. I hope this video proves to be of great help to you. If it was, go ahead and click on that subscribe and bell notification button. We got more great content on this channel such as this for you to delve into. Additionally, this is an unmonetized channel that may change in the future, but as of now, we make no money from these videos at the moment. If you'd like to make a donation, we gladly receive that through PayPal. Also, if you have any interest in buying any Saphir product, please do so by buying from one of our Amazon.com affiliated links in the description. It would help us out a great deal. Until next time, gentlemen, keep it classy.